All right, well, this morning I'm here with Van and uh, we got a pretty big project to work on. Uh, the last couple of months we've been dealing with a mink uh, getting into the chicken coop and uh, we've, we've lost a couple of ducks. And, and uh, finally the ground is thawed out enough for us to fix this problem. So this is gonna be a little bit of work, but I think we can do it. Um, we do have a second chicken coop inside the barn, but now that we have a whole bunch of baby ducks, they're kind of occupying that area. And uh, here, take a look at what they're doing in there. Getting their morning water and morning feed. So we're gonna get started. All right, Van, let's go. Yep. All right, so today we're gonna have two main objectives. Uh, one is to secure the outside of the barn below grade. You can see all the stuff that we've got stacked here all winter. Um, basically couldn't do much about it with the frozen ground. So we just kind of put as much material in the way of the mink as possible to make it as difficult as possible. And uh, the other is uh, it's ready to have spring clean out inside the coop. So we're gonna go in here and we're gonna get everything uh, raked out. And I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna cut some pallets and put them down on the ground just to make it that much more difficult if the mink is able to get through the fencing that we're gonna install on the outside. started to dig around the foundation a little bit and we're getting down there so that we can get all of this new fencing in uh, keep the uh, keep the predators out and uh, Sarah's inside the barn starting working in there how's it going peach all right well while I'm supposed to be digging a hole this is what's going on behind me these two goofballs they just want to be part of the action don't you don't you what do you think Sadie you want to help dig huh get your paws down in there so there's about a two long, month long uh, argument that's been happening in uh, in the house, which is where did the scissors go? And I think we just discovered Sarah was uh, working on sweeping everything out of here. And yep, sure enough, there's the scissors in the chicken coop for whatever reason. So we'll keep arguing about how they got there, but that's pretty funny that after a couple of months, we, we found them. <laughs> All right, well, we got our hole dug down a little ways and uh, we got some chicken wire we're gonna put in here. Now this probably isn't the best option uh, to keep minks out. There's better stuff out there like hardware wire uh, that is a lot more durable, but this is what we have free here and uh, we wanna use it up. So we're gonna start going with this and basically I'm just gonna go across and I'm gonna nail it to the top and then we're gonna backfill down in, into the bottom of the pit with it. Um, I put a little bit of a curl on the bottom that way anything that does kind of dig in once it hits the wire, if it tries to go down, it's just going to end up hitting more wire and hopefully we'll uh, give up and go away for the night. All right, well, we got just about the outside wrapped up now and Sarah's finishing up the inside. I got a little bit more to go down over here uh, where Deuce is hanging out. And uh, then we're gonna get to the inside. Sarah's just about done getting everything out of there. And uh, we had a little bit of extra material left over and Sarah and I thought that maybe it'd be a good idea if we put this material down on the ground in here and then set the pallets on top of it just to keep any predators that do make it through the outside coming up. It'll just make it that much harder for them to make their way into the chicken coop. All 